Hello. We're in the Membership Success Center, looking at club member satisfaction surveys. We find that link right here. When the page opens, you'll notice that the survey tool is really simple. It's simple to use, simple to take, simple to get the reports. This is the easiest way in the world to find out how your members feel about your club. I've created a survey for my club that we can take a look at in a minute. First, let's try this Create a Survey button. Now you can name your survey, which is just for your own reference. It's not part of what the user sees. And there's also a close date that defaults two weeks out, although it doesn't cut off access to the survey for latecomers. So once you name your survey, you'll see a Publish button on the right. That's all you need to do to create your survey. But perhaps you'd like to see what the survey looks like. While it's not editable, that adds complexity and makes surveys not comparable from club to club, you can page through the survey if you like. And we do that with the Get Started button. But let's save some time by just clicking the Publish button at the top. Now, here's where you need to decide how you're going to distribute this survey. It's a URL, a web page address, that is linked to a web page that's specific to your survey. You can distribute that in a simple email to all your members, if that's the way you usually do it. Or if it were me, I'd use DACDB Pmail and send a personalized message to each member. I've created a template like that to show you. So, Start by clicking Copy URL. Don't worry, if you lose track of it, you can always come back to the Surveys page and copy it again. So here's a simple little invitation I've built for this survey. It's all set up, and we'll just highlight Start Survey, and then the Link tool, and paste it in. That's it, you're all set. Now, you want to test anything you're about to send to dozens or hundreds of people, and first thing you want to do is save that template with the link that you just put in it. Then scroll up to the top, and you'll notice that your name always defaults as the recipient of a p-mail. That way you can send it to yourself as many times as it takes for you to convince yourself it's exactly what you want and that all the links work. So I'll just click send over here. And once you're completely satisfied with your template, just come back and send it to all your members. Now let's take a quick look at the survey by just pasting that same link right into the address bar. Here's how the survey opens up, and when we click the Get Started button, we're on the first page. Now let's go back to the Surveys window and see what the responses look like. Here's a survey where I've entered some responses. Let's have a look. Notice a button up here where you can download your survey as an Excel file, which makes it easier to look at the data in different ways. And that's really all there is to it. If you scroll down, you'll notice we ask some questions about member satisfaction with the club and Rotary in general. Then continue on asking some questions about why you joined Rotary, why you've stayed, and then a number of questions asking about your personal experience. So that's all there is to it. Making your club irresistible is about treating your members as customers. Now, while none of us respond to all the requests we get for customer feedback, Clearly enough people do that major companies all ask for customer opinions. There's a reason for that. They learn something from the responses they get. So if you wonder how to make your club more irresistible, try the survey tool in the Membership Success Center. It just couldn't be much easier. Thanks for watching.